I'd like to look at the nested vector oscillator as four separate oscillators being driven by four separate sequencers. It's going to work as long as you don't bump the sticks. So as long as the sticks are set on the horizontal axis, uh, they will not cross-modulate each other. And so you can tune them all to unison uh, or in harmonies or whatever. Uh, and they each have individual CV inputs, and they seem to track pretty well. So I have two five steps going in one to A and one to B, and two seven steps going into C and D. And here's what it sounds like. So yeah, tuning with uh, sticks is tricky. Uh, I, I do have to say that. It's, it takes some time and patience, but it's doable. Uh, also, uh, without changing those four different sequences, a fun game to play is let's discover new sounds. Uh, so that's what we're going to do for the next couple of minutes. I'm going to just randomly move those sticks and maybe stay on some patterns that interest me, uh, go to others that, you know, pass by some that I'm not quite sure what's going on. Uh, but hopefully you'll enjoy some of the discoveries. Okay, thanks for watching.